in this video we are going to play with using the loop counter so we've talked about the loop counter in terms of keeping track of the number of loops we've done but we can actually use this value to help us so what I've got here is a simple program that draws a hexagon lovely no problem there we should understand that by now now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it draw a hexagon three times round let's set the speed to 10 so it runs nice and quickly so it draws the hexagon three times round now here I've got the turtle dot move and each time it's going to move 50 if on the other hand I put in plus counter the first time round the loop it's going to move 51 because count will be 1 the second time it will move 52 because the count will be 2 and all the way to the last time it will move 68 because that's 50 plus 18 let's have a look at the output so we get this sort of rather pleasing spiral effect if I want to, I can do some maths on this. So counter times three, like that, and we'll get a somewhat broader spiral. So we can start to uh, have a look at some nice uh, effects. This could be a kind of nice sun in our house, for example. We can also, if we really want to do, do counter times counter. And what that means is it will broaden like that. So we get this kind of snail shell effect. Equally, we can change other things. So uh, I can change the pen width. And if I set that to I, You'll see the first line it will draw with a pen width of 1, then a pen width of 2, then a pen width of 3, all the way up to 18. Ha ha ha. Except it's not called I, it's called counter. I make mistakes all the time when I program. It's just a case of seeing why it's wrong and correcting it bit by bit. So there we are, and we can see it's getting thicker and thicker and thicker. Equally we could uh, adjust the turn. So we could move by 50 and we could move by 60, take away I each time. So when we turn, it's turning at a lesser angle. And except I've made the same mistake again, counter. There we are. So we take away the counter from the turn. There we are, and you can see it's kind of getting looser and looser and looser. And in fact, if I up this to 30, and you can see it's getting looser and looser and looser and looser, like that. Again, a nice looking kind of sun graphic. There are other things you can do as well. You're kind of limited by your imagination, but it just means that you can repeat a set of instructions and get something slightly different to happen each time based upon the value of the counter.